this word is often reduced. When it's unstressed in a sentence, it's not pronounced can, as in, yes, we can. In this case, it's stressed. Usually, it's pronounced as can. I can do it. This word is never reduced. So even if it's unstressed in a sentence, it's always going to have the pure vowel in it. And here we have again the a uh, as in cat that because of the n actually changes to can. Can't. Now I really popped the t here and that is perfectly fine. Can't. But you might struggle with hearing the difference because sometimes native speakers might not pop the t. The T after an N at the end of a word is usually a held T. And especially an, after an N, it almost feels like you are just stopping the N abruptly. Listen, can't, can't. 